It's God's grace that saves us. God gives us what we can't deserve, what we can't earn, what we can't perform well enough to, to get. You'll never be good enough. And that's one of the things that'll come out through this series is that so many of us, especially those raised in church and some of those not raised in church, we, we think somehow you've got to perform to earn God's love. That somehow being a good Christian is like a term. There isn't good Christian. Because there's nobody good, biblically speaking, from God's perspective. That's not how he sees it at all. That all of us are sinners in need of a savior. That his grace is the only way of salvation. And how we receive it is by faith, by choosing to believe in him, to place our faith in him as the rescuer. The bear comes from behind. He's chasing me. I start running. Right? And Jim gets up, and Jim happens to be carrying. You know what I mean? <laughs> Cheryl gets up next to him. She's packing two. <laughs> right? Rescuer, savior is this. I'm running. And I get to those guys, and I see them stand up. And they're pulling weapons. I'm thinking, thank you, Jesus. Because I'm thinking between me and a bear or there's a wall of lead getting ready to happen. You tracking? We're running through life. We're trying to do things. We're paying bills. We're raising kids. We're doing stuff. We even come to church, you know. Like we kind of believe, you know. We kind of, you know, it's like we got some, you know, I don't know. I'm just kind of doing my thing. And we're running. There's a bear chasing us. You know, it's like we're, they're constantly, there's something going on. It, it could be in our finances. It could be in our health. It could be in our marriage. It could be in our work. It could just be stress and anxiety. For heaven's sakes, we just survived 2020. It, life is chasing us. Sometimes we need to stop and recognize there's one man who said, I'll be your savior. Savior. 